Bonjour et bienvenue sur un nouvel épisode de On peut le dire. It's been ages, I know, but better late than never. The last video on this playlist was about syllables in French words and how to recognize them in French speaking. So now we're going to look at how we can use that knowledge to make sure that we put our stress or our emphasis on the right part of our French words. Let's go. So syllables and word stress. In French, we have what we call an accent tonique which is when we put a stress on the last syllable of a word. This is ob obviously applicable to words with more than one syllable, because if you have one syllable, of course, you're going to emphasize that one. But if you have more than one, then in French, we emphasize the last one. Never mind. So I'm going to be using words we had in the previous video on syllables, but only the ones that had more than one syllable. What we're going to do is we're going to run through the list. I'm going to say the words, and then you're going to have some time to repeat the words and you want to aim at emphasizing or putting a stress on the underlined syllable, which is the last syllable. So the first example has two syllables. And we go bonjour, bonjour. And sometimes it can help to add a little gesture to emphasize. So you can nod on the syllable you're emphasizing. You can put your hand forward. You could even click. You could tap your foot on the last one. So just do anything physical that helps you really make it clear which syllable you're emphasizing. So, bonjour. Hopefully that was time enough for you to repeat. Next one. We have three syllables this time. And we'll go ennuyeux. 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 Don't hesitate to pause if I'm not giving you enough time to um, repeat after me. Next one, three syllables again. We have aujourd'hui. Aujourd'hui. We have even a little extra here, which is in French, when the word ends in E, we tend to add a little sound, aujourd'hui. But you don't have to do it, aujourd'hui. One syllable, just to show you how it works, and also because this word is potentially difficult to say, train. Train. This word could be either three syllables or two syllables. Most of the time French people will say it in two, so I'm going to say it in two. Avion. Avion. Next we have voiture. Voiture. So the final E doesn't have an accent, which means it's a weak sound, and that's why the two on all together is considered one syllable. Voiture. I like that word, obviously. <laughs> Cheval. 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 Another nice one. Français. Français. So I did two different pronunciations there. The official one should be Français with an open E. Uh, but in the north of France, where I come from, we tend to say Français with a closed E. They're both fine. And I, in time, it's a bit more rare to hear a proper E sound at the end. So that's, that's a bit up to you. And finally, a borrowed one, weekend, weekend, it said weekend, so that's it. I've just tricked myself into thinking it was the weekend, it's not, it's Tuesday, this is not the weekend. Awesome, so this was it for our practice of accent tonique, which is where we put the stress on the last syllable of a word. I think, if I remember properly, the plan is for the next video to be on the emphasis within a phrase, which is basically, instead of putting the emphasis on the last syllable of a word, you put it on the last syllable of your phrase. So it's pretty simple, you just now expand the area you're looking at. This is probably going to be our next video. Let me know if you have any questions or comments, uh, leave some feedback in the comments below, give it a like if this video helped you, you can share it if you know some people that might benefit from it. And if anyone has some like little sentences or text that they don't know how to pronounce and they would like some help or some coaching step by step to practice it, feel free to give that to me as well and we can make a video out of it. Hopefully it will be sooner than in the next 10 months, but we'll get there. Thank you for watching, have a great time and don't forget, on peut le dire. I don't remember if I should point that way if it's the last one or that way if it's the last one because I haven't done this forever so um, hopefully it'll be right and if I do it wrong I'll just flip this in editing and then it will be right so I don't know why I'm telling you this you do not need to hear it